Hey guys, welcome to Langrisa LCA, where the excitement never ends. So here comes a new week for the free commoners challenge, SS5. So yeah, mm, this new timeless event. Oh gosh, I hate this. Um, so apparently everyone will get to revive once with um no well, a resurrection with 30% of your HP back. And it will trigger only once for everybody. So, yup, you hear me right, everyone. And, yup, I will not use um, all... Nope, definitely I will not be using any of the SSR characters. And the SR will be the VIP Fure. And, yup, I will not even be using... Dirhato. Yep. There is no such character. I beg to differ. <laughs> Alright, so here's a lime up. Sherry. Well, free. Bozo. Free. Matthew or Mashu. Free. Okay, events character. Iris and. Yep, our VIP. Free. Uh, so, um, apparently, if you're well trained for your characters, you can apparently give him the Holy Knight. Um, as it raised um, the maximum of 40% or 45% magic defense, correct me if I'm wrong. So, um, in case if you got to take skill damage from um, Lana, so you can have a greatly reduced. And apparently, yep, on the enemy team, we'll have the princess faction. So, we have Luna. Sherry, Nam, Tiaris, and Lana. So, yep, gotta beware of Lana. And alright, here we go. So, apparently, um, first turn, um, we'll be, well, moving our characters to the correct positions. And as long as you do not enter the danger zone, enemy will not start their turn. So, alright, um, apparently, um, due to the movement of Freya, we will be starting all the actions from turn 3 onward. So alright, gotta go fast, gotta go fast. Alright, so, um, hmm, second turn. Right, um, I think I'll just switch on lens for legs. So we got very good RNG here. We'll be, Bozo will be able to um, silent every character or at least the mage character which was a more important role because um apparently Lana have black hole and that can do some random debuff that you can't really know so apparently yep after doing this we'll be ending our turns <coughs> come on straight on next turn we'll be casting another skill so yep so we'll be wasting at least a one charge of lens for legs Right, then we will be opening the Rose Iron Maiden, yeah, sorry, Rose Iron, no, not Iron Maiden, I guess some, some Rose thingy. Alright, so, yep, I'll be casting Earthquake to reduce down damage and, woohoo, okay, managed to silence a lot, huh? so, okay, guess I should have cast the Bro, skill first instead. Uh, okay, so never mind. Um, <clears throat> at this position, so yep. Um, Matthew will coming out, and yep, he will finish off Nam once. And then, all right. So Iris will be teleporting Cherry over. <coughs> So right, we are not going to waste out much time and without further ado, we will be trying to finish off Nam and next um we will be aiming for okay spellcaster Lana Well this is I'm trying to re find ways to reduce damage um, output from the enemy as much as possible and more or less, um, since Freya is there, she'll be able to protect the allies from physical damage. So, yep. However, um, the skill is gonna expire on the fourth turn. So, yep. Gotta watch out. 
Apparently that might be a bad move, but well, we gonna try, so... Whoa! Almost dead once, but... Oh. Right, so... Um, actually, the good idea will be trying to finish Terry's off ASAP, but apparently that will leave your team kind of wide open. Um, and that's why I have decided to finish off the enemy... Um, range fighter and mage instead so right um so no more skew to cast so yep and left with the rose skewy and yep just gonna end my turn for free up heal up a bit and yep gonna try to let matthew finish off lana but before that a buff a negative buff black hole so yep um my earthquake clogged the previous turn, but I'm not gonna try trying my best not to use the same skill. So, in case you guys um, who are trying to follow the video are uh, not having a very good RNG, and then yep, Matthew's going to finish Lana once. Um, then yep, Sherry will be trying to finish off her the second time, and yep. So Iris will be casting the self. Healing teleportations and heal everyone's up. <clears throat> so okay, apparently I had a bad move. Um, so at a at a start, I should have cast the uh, um, rose skill instead of lens for leg. So well, a bad move for me. But don't worry, guys, we are still able to clear the stage. Apparently, um, Sherry died. So. Well, resurrect once, so there is still time for it. And I'm gonna give you guys a big debuff. And just so you know, if you're not gonna use AoE, you don't have any clock. Um, in this case, I would prefer to attack Sherry. Normal attack Sherry and give her a, a more debuff, so um, she'll be softer to damage with right so yep iris will definitely gotta kill sherry so heal 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 gotta heal her back to life and since lance for lex is up right now well um have no fear freya is here so yep we'll be trying our best to finish off the enemy sherry and apparently um oh she's tough and yup, Freya, kudos for Freya for tanking the damage. Woo. And yup, all the nice equipment from Freya. And well, if, in case you guys um think Freya is not a character to be invest, um, it's quite true for now because in uh, longer terms, um, she's not a very nice character in PvP because a lot of, I gotta say, rich players um, probably will have items like um, braces. So, um, fret not, um, in future there will be SP mode Freya, which apparently um, no one will be able to immune fixed damage if the enemy is a mixed unit so well fret not all right so back to the game sorry got a bit off track but yep basically it's just a normal attack on the characters and now we'll be trying to finish off luna okay so yep mm, free i will try to attack her so so ooh, probably i'm not we are not doing a lot of damage but well fret not Lens for Lex is here, and yep, we've did a reflect damage. So apparently for this um, stage, I have been using quite basically. I kind of rip off my equipment from um, Landis. So yep. <laughs> All right, so we will definitely be able to finish um, Luna this round. So okay, I'll just leave the attacking to Sherry. Instead, so yep, the city is off done, and yep. All right, so now we will be back to business, and 
we'll be trapping Tiaris in the middle. So go, Sherry. And last, it will be Matthew giving the final blow. If not, well, you we have two more spans characters. And congratulations, guys. You have did it. And how big a surprise. Oh, Lord. Braces. Dimension Jewel. Break. Oh, come on, seriously. Oh, my God. Oh, this is really a bad week for me, man. Oh, my God. First is my lucky draw. Failure of lucky draw with so many Tiara and now this, seriously. Um, well, apparently I can give this to Yusuke from Yu Yu Hakushu. Okay, so... <sighs> Got to think happy. So, yep, um, character's equipment. So, Bozo um, always gave him as item that can provide an enhancement to provide as much magical defense as possible. As for Mashu, apparently I'll give him the kiss of the devil, devil's kiss, axe. Um, so can do extra damage, follow up, and give him last ride, um, Eye of Jumanga. Um, or whatever you call that. So if you do not have last ride, you can give him twilight armor to boost um, his de defense and magic defense as much as possible. So Sherry will have Ragnarok, last ride, and helmet, anything goes, and for accessories, um, something that can give her as much attack as possible and for enchantment uh, probably it's more suggest to go for rough sea so yep and if you do not have ragnarok you can give her um another pair of double eggs apparently you'll work better for the troops like angel because enemy is at full hp all right for healers um as much healing as possible so i gotta submit i mean i cheat a little by giving her this Healzilla accessory. So apparently, um, Sherry managed to get um, damage reduction buff for three turns from Iris instead of two turns. And apparently, if you do not have that, you should give her um, the Faddle to prevent stun and increase your healing um, percentage as much as possible. Last but not least, the VIP. Look at the Tushi ice cream. Mm -hmm. So, yep, apparently I gave her the World Tree Steak and Mary Armor, her exclusive, which apparently works better if you, if you are at um, the Valkyrie. And apparently I'm not, I'm giving her Royal Guard. And for accessory, I forgot to change um, <coughs> since the last Yu Yu Hakushu collaboration. Um, apparently, if you got um, that actually, that's a bad item for her. For the ring, it will be the Bone Ash to um, reflect more damage, especially for um, close combat. So, yep. Alright, so for Bone, um, too much consideration. Um, I have kind of maxed a lot of the characters that I will be using for PvP and also SS characters. So, okay, I'm just gonna show characters who that do not have full bond yet. So, like Bozo, um, except for the rig bond, which he do not really need, um, basically I just max most of it. And then for free, uh, so where's... Yep. <clears throat> okay, apparently I do not have much um material yet i intend to max freya's bond but for now um you can again like bozo skip the rig bond because she do not depend much on attack unless you want critical and for your heart bond um it will be uh, i would really suggest to go um at a minimum of level four and of course the higher the battle and yep so that's it, we have come to the end of SS5 and wish you guys